Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific a crackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle the stadium has that feel of a genuine coliseum it could only be rome things have got on the way here pretty promptly jim you've played in games of this nature who can make the difference of course Manuel Neuer he doesn't just dominate his area Peter he seems to control the whole of the defensive third he's excellent at mopping up any balls that make it through that defensive line and what's more he can often turn those interceptions into lethal counter attacks too well, he would be the obvious choice wouldn't he he certainly has all the right qualities oh that's neat deep cross it's a brilliant interception to go with all this possession oh well intercepted really alert to the danger Goretzka oh no that's not the ball he wanted Gnabry 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 hits one oh what a wonderful stop well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Goes for goal! Goal, Germany! That's wonderfully done. Chris Pitt, true finish. And as the ball came to him, he had to make a quick decision. And on that occasion, it was spectacular. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. <laughs> Lorenzo Insigne. And here's Immobile. Schuller plays it forward. Gnabry drives it forward. And they're not going to make any further progress now. And it's Insigne. Bernadeschi. Oh, shooting chance! Really well taken goal. They have brought themselves an equaliser. Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway.
that has certainly made things interesting well there's resilience for you peter as a side they never lost focus despite the setback and this is thoroughly merited for me now they can go on better possibly great strength too strong for his opponent and it's got through shapes the shoots it's come back out he's pulled off a fine save well as tesco peter the keeper has just received an a plus grade up he gets goal germany and they've got their lead back great corner and he did the rest well as contact goes that was tremendous and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net i think when it comes to the aerial department this fella is definitely no slouch germany take the lead oh good take in a good area he's had a shot oh, it's a fine challenge and it goes his way Oh, checking back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here. Gets into a dangerous position. Gnabry. He's found his man. It has got chance! It's in! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight! Speed of thought, efficiency of movement, and certainty of outcome. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Germany take a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking... It's one! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. And it goes for it! It's pr And a second time! Insigne at his razor sharp best there. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. This is threatening to become a really good game. I think they can sense a comeback here, and so can this crowd. It's all systems go now. It's come loose. Now it's Goretzka. Not the worst cross in the world, but still room for improvement. Werner gets it back. It's Canabri. Oh, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. That was created because of good, lively movement, which pretty much dictated the pass. The whistle for half time. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. Germany hold a skinny lead after a thrilling half. Bring on the second half. It's 3 2. Action is back on the way. Questions were asked, and he's given the answers. Marco Verratti. Chiesa really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Done very well to intervene. Lorenzo Insigne. This is gone, that's a foul.
Berateski. Werner. Henricks tries to get it forward quickly. Gnabry. Gnabry goes for goal. He scores! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front, and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. He's made it three. Quite a day at the office for him. Well, he's been the outstanding player on the pitch and devastating in front of the goal. What a display. Chiesa! Chooses to go back. Big chance! Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. Italy really are in the ascendancy here, and they know they have to register while that's the case. We can assume that they've been instructed by the boss to, to stay in attack. They're just looking to break, aren't they? Yeah, the key now is just to get the ball to them as soon as possible. Oh, he's not going to get that. Bernardeschi. Ball's loose, who's getting there? And they've been caught out here. Looking to... Has a pop! They are rampant! And they are pulling clear here. Smartly deceptive, what quality. Oh, it's lovely to see the art of disguise alive and well, but the keeper straight into no man's land. Germany lost themselves into a three-goal lead. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. And it's played forward. Beautifully done. Hit into the middle. Well read, he sorted that out. Immobile. That's a decent ball. Chiesa. That's the throw. Henricks. He's through the middle. Gnabry. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. He gets the ticking off and needs to be very careful now. Yeah, and he has to change his ways or this referee could soon change his status. Chiesa. Immobile. It's Immobile! It's there! Just so calm under pressure. I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, that. Italy give themselves a fighting chance, back in with a shout. And it's Goretzka. Gnabry, Werner, Werner! And that would have won it. Werner should really have closed the game out then, and this could come back to haunt him. Marco Verratti. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Kira. Goretzka. Got offside that time.
Rudiger. Keira. Insignia. Pretty robust, but it's got the job done. Insignia, a scorer already in the game. And here's Immobile. Quick drop and the finish! I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Werner, going through. Trout calling for him to shoot. Forward it goes. Chiesa. Oh, it's Immobile. Oh, the question, that's a foul. Berodeski. Added time is 